first sign of labor is bleeding. Now, bright red blood can happen. You don't want to see a lot of that or you need to call your physician, but dark brown blood can be a sign that labor's starting. And so bright red blood can also be a sign. It can also be a sign of getting checked or having sex. The second sign of labor is losing your mucus plug. Now that does not mean you are having the baby right away. It's just kind of a sign that your cervix is softening. Usually you use your mucus plug when you wipe or in the toilet after you pee. Um, it is usually dark brown and mucusy and it is so. The third sign of labor is back pain. Now you probably have a lot of back pain towards the end of pregnancy anyway, but it's more of like a cramping back pain than just like I'm hauling around a giant watermelon in my belly back pain. So it is different. You'll kind of notice a different feeling, but it can be a sign of labor. The fourth sign of labor is contractions. And clearly that makes sense, right? Because labor is contractions. But in your third trimester, you might have contractions now and then or frequently, and that's normal. Check with your doctor about how many is okay at how many weeks you are. It really depends on your circumstances and all that kind of stuff. But starting to have contractions that become more regular and frequent and stronger is a sign of labor. It is also a sign that you could go out of labor. So, you know, when you have contractions every 10 minutes, that's not really a sign of labor. It's just an eye, something to keep an eye on. So contractions, you usually feel them in your back or your belly first and then as they progress you'll start to feel them all over your abdomen often all over your back as well so all of those are contractions because your uterus is in the middle of your abdomen so it just kind of depends on how the baby's positioned as to where you feel them i have a whole post on what a contraction feels like that you might want to check out in case you're like i don't know what i'm feeling for the fifth sign of labor which is one that people don't really know is your stomach kind of wants to get in on the action too so you might have some nausea some diarrhea just some like uncomfortable stomach feelings. A lot of that is your body clearing it out so you can have a baby. The sixth sign of labor is that your water breaks. Now, it sounds like it would be really clear, but it's not. Usually when your water breaks, it'll keep coming out. So you might get a gush and then it'll just keep coming out. And so that's how you know, but the hospital can tell for sure. If you think your water broke, call your doctor. The seventh sign of labor is changes in discharge, which makes the sixth sign of labor extra confusing because things are just different down there. You might get a little brownish. You might get some bleeding, all those kind of things. So changes in discharge. Final sign of labor for us here on the TikTok is that it just continues. Contractions start getting harder and longer and closer together. Water keeps coming out. Discharge keeps changing. You might start bleeding. I have a whole post on how to know if you're in labor. Check it out through the link in my profile.